All right, let's get back into the action, shall we? Hello and what is up you guys? <laughs> so in this upcoming series, I will deep dive you into all the new features of the Hero 9 Black. For today's video, we will be talking about the all new Time Warp 3.0, which is my absolute favorite feature. So I'm in an awesome spot in Thailand right now. There's graffiti on the wall. Um, I think we are going to get some really awesome time warps. So, let's get into the action! Hey, a quick intermission. Some of you might be wondering, what is Time Warp? Time Warp is basically a super stabilized time-lapse video, aka a hyperlapse. So Time Warp is a term coined by GoPro. Within it, there are various speed options, from Auto to 30x. I'll tell you what, I'll put a table up on screen so that it can help with my explanation. So, two main things to consider. Number one, the duration of the activity that you're doing. And number two, the type of motion, how intense is the activity. So as a rule of thumb, um, the, higher the, the, higher, the longer the activity and higher motion the activity is, you want to use a larger speed option like 30x. Um, if this is all too complicated for you, that's where the auto speed selection comes in. And that's my personal favorite. You know, this entire video, I've shot it in the auto speed selection because the GoPro camera is able to detect and adjust the speed based on lighting condition, based on the speed that you're traveling at. And that is great because sometimes as I'm walking down the street, I never know when the traffic light is going to turn red, when it's going to turn green, when I'm going to stop, when I'm going to run. Um, so yeah, I hope this little explanation helps you in understanding what time warp is and what speed selection is. So let's carry on with some time warps and I will show you how do you do some of these other awesome features that I speak about. The new speed ramp in Time Warp 3.0 simply tap the screen to enable real speed with audio like this <laughs> so that you can vlog wow in Time Warp. All right, let's get back into the action, shall we? All right, one thing that I want to call out is that you not only can trigger speed ramp by tapping the screen, you can as well trigger speed ramp by tapping the mode button on the side and that is great for instances where you can't tap the screen all right <laughs> what do you think about that epic slow motion effects during your time warp by simply tapping that speed dial icon and you can now go into half speed during your time warp. Alright, so if you are enjoying the video, don't forget to hit the like button, drop in a comment and smash that subscribe button right now. Let's get back into time warp. Alright, now that you got the basics down, let's talk about taking that time warp game to the next level. So here are three of my favorite shooting tips for time warp. Oh. 
always, always keep your subject in the center of the frame. By turning on that grid lines in the menu, that will enable you to frame your shots and compose it better. Give it a go. Number two, keep your camera motion simple and intended. Forward, backwards, side by side. That would enable you to create really compelling time walks. Give it a go. Well, for complicated sequences, toggle the linear plus horizon leveling lens to get the most epic and stable time walk. Like this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and that's it for this week's video on how to create better and more amazing time walks. Well, if you enjoyed today's video, please stay subscribed to the channel because in this series, I will be talking about the different key features of the Hero 9 Black. So if you want to learn more, please hit the like button, drop in a comment, let me know what other topics that interest you. And till then, I will see you guys in the next upload. <laughs>